Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Luke, thank you very much for watching. Do appreciate it. I'm gonna start by apologizing for lack of content. It is completely my bad. Um, I just haven't really been feeling up for uploading content, um, but I'm starting to get back into the swing of things again now. Um, so hopefully more videos are gonna be coming up soon. I just noticed you're not on tap exactly straight, are you? Let's uh, straighten it up, there you go. Yeah, looking good, looking good. So we've got, uh, today, we've got five runs planned to Newbury and back. Um, but I'm thinking of making this vlog so that it's uh, some of today, some of tomorrow, maybe some of Wednesday, some of something different every day and then upload it at the end of the week and then you get to see a lot of different stuff rather than the, just the same job backwards and forwards. So that's what I'm thinking about doing. Uh, but yeah, for today, we've got five runs planned to Newbury. Oh, sweet! Four rat, four runs, not five, four runs. <laughs> that makes things a bit easier today, four runs. So yeah, four, four runs. I'm just doing my paperwork. Uh, so every run has a, um, uh, like, oh, a sheet, basically, of paperwork that needs to be doing. So I'm just filling in the paperwork now, customer details, the address, uh, putting my tar weight in, which is 13,500. That's how much I weigh empty. Um, and then I need to obviously go get loaded and stuff. So that's what we're doing today. So look forward to seeing you later. We're actually at the moment inside, um, I'm not gonna say where we are because I've been asked not to show anything. So we're inside our place of work where we start in the morning. And uh, yeah, just doing some paperwork. Uh, five more minutes and we'll be good to go according to the taco because obviously we've got to allow for 15 minute daily check, which we've done. So yeah. Let's uh, crack on and do some paperwork, and I'll see you in a little bit when we're outside. It's a little bit lighter, and we're on our way to our job. Right, we're just uh, in the queue now to get weighed. We are loaded with what we need while we're waiting. I put my sheet on. Uh, yeah, so we're just waiting for another vehicle to come off, and then we can uh, get ourselves weighed and make our way. We're going to Newbury Market Street specifically. I've been there before. Um, been a been there on two separate occasions actually so it'll be interesting to see what it's like now because obviously the last times i was there they weren't there were no houses built up there might be houses there now so yes come on okay right he's finally coming off when he comes out we can go on to the way bridge all oh, right you're going there okay i deliberately left room on my right for you but he wants to go on the left anyway Bam, bam, bam. Thirty-one four hundred. Thank you. So we weigh thirty-one tons and four hundred kilograms. That is our gross weight. We know our tire weight is thirteen five hundred. So we've got to take 13,500 away from 31,400 and then that will be our net weight, which is how much product we are carrying. So, let's try my calculator. hundred. take away 13,500 equals 17,900. 17,900. That's how much we're carrying. Ugh. Let's get our seatbelt on and then let's get rock and rolling to Newbury. Let's go. Woo! Oh, I just thought we've got to go through the wheel wash first. So that's what we're doing now. We went down into the tip. So very muddy tyres. So, as we are courteous to other road users, we shall wash our tyres and underside. Okay, now we're done. Let's go! Jap, you can't ignore it. I'm transforming now, these cars and planes. I'm always boarding. Just out touring down in Charlotte, like I play for Hornets. When I'm performing, never boring. Now you can't afford it. Champagne Perrier, finished friends on my face. Looking like I'm from the D. D's no Cartier. Pockets deep, 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 bro. I can make it in my seat, bro. Do you and do me, bro. Right, 
we are in Newbury. Uh, and we're just, well actually, if you look over there in front of you, you might see a crane. That's where we're going, I believe. Just behind there. Someone on the CB piped up saying, um, they don't want it in the bottom, they want it in the top. They said not at the, where the train station is, they want it in the top bit, which is where I was going to go anyway. So, hopefully uh, we'll be all right. We do want to get into lane two. Thank you. Yeah, so hopefully we find the right place. I was going to go in that way anyway, but like I said, might be a chance that we, uh, we, we get in the wrong place. We shall see. Stay green, stay green, stay green. Thank you, car on the left. And red lights, <laughs> nice. Uh, so those of you who follow me on um, social media, like Facebook and Instagram and all that, will know that um, I purchased a, a brand new drone. Uh, it was, it's called the Mavic Air 2. Got to say it right, because I, I was saying Maverick for a while. It's Mavic. <laughs> Mavic Air 2. But after just four minutes of fly time, I, um, well, I crashed it, <laughs> basically. Oh, there's one of our trucks coming out of the job now, look. You might pipe up in the CB in a sec. Yeah, I, um, I was flying in my back garden um, sensibly for three minutes, <laughs> for three and a half minutes. And then I put it into sport mode. And um, when it's in sport mode, the sensors that stop it from crashing don't work. <sighs> And, uh, yeah, it got broken. Where did he go then? I saw our driver just now, but I didn't see where he went. Oh, there it is. Curious now as to why he's come around this way. He's empty. He is empty. Last time I come here, you come in this way and you come out that way and you just go straight back on the A34 that way. So I'm not entirely sure what he's coming down this way for. We'll soon see. But yeah, that big old yellow crane, look, that's the uh, the job. I don't know where we're tipping on site though. Well, he's gone back in there for some reason. Or maybe he is loaded. I don't know. I don't know. Right, we're going to turn left here. Right, situation is, I'm not entirely sure what's happening. He is empty and he's getting loaded by the looks of it. But I don't know, they're laughing, so. <laughs> New idea. So I think I'm backing in there then. Here we go. Yeah, we're backing in where uh, Matey Boy was. The other guy was hey, empty. Hey. The other guy was empty and he needs to get loaded. Um, and they thought he was loaded and wanted to get empty. That's where we want it. Right, it's gonna be noisy while I lift the body up. going to go forward. Hopefully we're going to hear a bang. There we go. It's just the last bit that's coming out. 
I need to get a signature. Oi, mate. Can you sign? Yeah. Yeah. Good, bud. Just down there for me. You having a good morning? Yeah, not too bad, mate. Thank you very much. There we go, buddy. All right, have a good day. Not sure what I said. Have a good day. Because uh, I normally say that if I'm not coming back. And I am coming back. <laughs> right, let's turn the uh, hazards off. Beacons off. And out we go. <coughs> so it should be a case. Tailgate is shut. Should be a case of going out the same way we come in. Excellent. And we put my seatbelt on now that I've finished doing manoeuvring. Yeah, so, not too bad. Now we know where it is. Next time we can um, come straight back and go straight in. But yeah, matey boy that was here before me, he was empty um, and needed to be loaded somewhere. Green light, mate. Oh, I just realized we can't go right. I wanted to go right. <laughs> We've got to try and find our way out of here now. Let's use uh, ge geographical knowledge. We want to be heading in that direction somewhere. I haven't got a sat nav. <laughs> Just trying to find my way out. Uh, yeah, it's gonna. It's gotta be down here, isn't it? Yeah, it's down here. Lovely. Yeah, we'll take a left on this roundabout, and then we'll. Uh, yeah, there we go. Oxford A34. That's where we want to go. Back to Sanford on the Vale. KFC's open. Oh man, KFC's open. Can I stop anywhere here for lunch? I'll have to have a look on the next uh, the next passing. <laughs> right, let's go back, get reloaded with some more 6F5 recycled and make our way back here. I'll, um, I'll show you one more delivery here at least and then um, and then we'll see. The next you might see will be from tomorrow or the day after or something like that, different sites. So I'm trying to mix it up a little bit. Right, let's go get reloaded. Okay, so we are on our way back now to deliver our second load of uh, 6F5 recycled, uh, which is basically like uh, big rocks with a bit of bit of muck in it as well, but like recycled, so it's clean-ish. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're, we're going to go deliver that, and then we've just had a phone call from the office asking us to take away some tarmac from the same site, which I think is what that truck was doing this morning when we got there. So I'm pretty sure we're going to have to tip this where we were as earlier. Then go around to the other side of the site, which, you're thinking about it, we're going to have to go a long way around because we can't do that right hand turn. So yeah, we'll have to go back around to the other way, go through um, the train station, and I think go in that entrance, I think. We'll find out when we get there. But um, yeah, we're going to get loaded with tarmac planings, take that back to the quarry, tip that off, and then get reloaded with our third load. So it's just basically a backload. <sighs> oh, wow, you ordered. I'm not that tired, to be fair. So yeah, we've got a, uh, a backload. So it will will actually be five runs technically now for the day, but um, yeah, not too bad, not too shabby. Anyway, we're nearly there. We've been there in about 15 minutes, so I'll see you when we're a little bit closer. Okie dokie, we're nearly here. Yeah. I'm just wondering where these uh, the tarmac planers are. As I said, I reckon they're um, around the other side, which would be interesting. I'm able to get some good drone footage in Newbury. It's quite nice. Yeah, you uh, you overtake quickly, mate, because I'm going to get to lane two. Because I will need to be in lane two anyway. Uh, yeah, now that I've got the drone, well, technically, I, although it's not actually in my possession right now because it's on its way to the Netherlands to be fixed <laughs> um, I'm on the lookout for like um, decent drone areas to like get some nice like shots I want to like get a collection of like b-roll like just loads of b-roll loads of shots um, so like if I was ever in Newbury and I was at this roundabout I could maybe have a b-roll of the roundabout I don't know stuff like that 
I need to look into some stuff. There's something called PCFO, which is uh, a license to fly drones commercially. I'm, uh, I'm already CAA approved, which is the Civil Aviation Authority. I've got a pilot's license, so to speak. <laughs> they call it an operator's ID and flyer's ID. I've got that, that's ready to go. I just need to determine whether uploading to YouTube uh, whilst monetizing is classified as commercial. I'm, it might be, you know, it might be. So I might just need to look into it. But a lot of my drone footage is gonna be on my second channel, which is not monetized. So therefore I'm not gaining uh, a reward from it. So it is purely rec recreational use pretty much. Ugh. Right, so yeah, I think I've got to go down there, I think, for the tarmac planings, which means I'll have to come back round this way again, because you can't come up this way, because it's a one-way system. We shall soon see. It's quite quiet still, isn't it? Even though, like, more and more places are opening up now, it's still quite quiet. Watch the kid. Imagine climbing up to that, <laughs> that crane, Jesus. All right, we're gonna get a left here. All right, he's gonna open the gate for me. Seat back off so I can concentrate. <laughs> Gotta take your seat back off to concentrate. Turn the music down <laughs> and take your seatbelt off. Before we move, I'm just going to undo the sheet. Gives them time to open the gate then as well. Bam, 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 nearly there. Come on. Oh, he's coming over to me, I think. All right, mate. Yeah. Now we will be going a bit further. Yeah. Between the crane and the digger, basically, there is this. Yeah, just crane. watch me back. I, I've, I've got to get some tarmac planings as well. Say again. Tarmac planings. Tarmac. Is there? Yeah, yeah, I've got to take some away. I, you, you, I think that will be down the bottom. Uh, by the train station? Yes. Yeah, yes. okay, mate. All right. Yeah, as I thought. Watch me back then, mate. We're turning left, are we? Yeah. Is his hand up? I can't see. Yeah. Du, 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 du. When, they're, when they're on the passenger side, it's like just a little bit harder to see them. I'd much rather prefer they're on the driver's side, but... Never mind! There you go, buddy! Yeah, and it's not right now, we'll be down the train track. By the train track, all right, mate. It should, it should be. Should be. <laughs> all right, mate. No worries, have a good day. I said it again, why do I keep saying have a good day? I'm coming back. <laughs> uh, right. I've got no paperwork written out ready for this collection. Bang. Oh, that was a loud one. That's just the uh, the tailboard banging from the pile. Don't know. It's like it's hard to explain. Like uh, when you tip you tip your body up and the pile comes out, but the tail is like the other side of the pile. So when you sort of come off the pile, the tailboard just goes bang. All right, body's down. Tailgate locked. 
Should be. Just gonna check it's locked quickly before I leave. <sighs> See you later, mate. Yeah, tailgate is locked. There's no rocks on the back. So now we've got to try and find these tarmac planings. Can I go left? I don't know. Better give way to the right. <coughs> right, so let's go try and find these tarmac planings. Should just be the other side of the side, but we've got to do a massive detour just to get there. Well, it's not a massive detour. I just got an email from TomTom. -Tom. Huh. I think they want me to try out a new Tom Tom. Uh, uh, uh. Go this way. So yeah, I've got, to, uh, I've got to do some more research on the drones because obviously I know Civil Aviation Authority, I know some of the rules on that. Well, I know all the rules because I've had to research it, but... So, above like buildings, you need to be 50 feet. I think like from that one, maybe even 150 feet, I don't know. Like I said, I need to do some more research. Oh, I'm getting this lane down here, look. Because I'm going right. Lights turn green. Oh yeah, I didn't even look then to see if KFC were open. Uh, I ain't got enough time to get back. <laughs> I've got an hour and 20 minutes of driving time left. Should be able to get loaded and get to the quarry, get tipped, and then have a break. And I'll have two more to do this afternoon. Let's go down here. Arctic in lane one. Yeah, I think my, my GoPro microphone battery is running out, so um, there might not be any decent audio. Yeah, it's just run out. <laughs> Unfortunately, the audio is not going to be great now because I'm running on just the GoPro. It's just while I'm uh, finding this site. I forgot to charge it up, didn't I, before I left? Turn green, turn green. There we go, turn green. Oh, there's two behind me as well. What is this car doing now? Turn around. How's the lorries coming around the corner? someone stops you is a good idea but no one seems to be stopping me. Obviously going to be loaded by a digger. There's no one here man.
Okay, the situation is this. Uh, I don't know if you can quite see on the dash cam. Yeah, you can. The uh, bloke in front trying to find out where they want me. Pardon me? Yeah. yeah. There's tarmac, yeah. Yeah, alright, mate. Alright, so he's on break apparently. I need to spin round there. I'm facing the wrong way. He said it's this machine here. Doesn't look like time out there, to me. I love it when people just stop and watch. <laughs> there's someone over there watching. So, uh, yeah, anyway, there's a couple of guys behind me at least, so um, I think they're going to be coming in here as well. Potentially, who knows. But, uh, yeah, never mind. Right, see you in a bit. <laughs> okay, so the bloke now in front has just told me that um, there is no tarmac down here, it's at the top. Um, he's also said it's not much and it might not even be tarmac. So, I'm being... I'm being sent to different places now on the same site so pretty standard for this industry i'm now gonna have to call my office up and just let them know as well so happy days <laughs> okay situation is this i've called the office and they've called me to, they've told me to uh leave it and uh so I've got to come back anyway, and I'm just wasting time. Oh yeah, they're on break, so... It's a good two hour drive to, back to the quarry and back again, and then I can just take it back on the next one, because I'm coming back anyway. So there's no point sitting there for 15 minutes doing nothing, although I could have got a break in, but... Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I've decided to just vlog today, um, and then maybe do a vlog tomorrow, and doing the vlog the day after and so on and so forth but today's vlog is going to be just one video I think uh, get it all in one video get it uploaded hopefully either tonight or tomorrow fingers crossed situation now is so when we last came here we had to get a load of tarmac but they didn't know where it was one minute it was down the bottom then it was up the top and then matey boy went for a walk I phoned the office up and the office told me to just crack on go get reloaded with 6F5 which is actually what's right in front of you there that, that is the 6F5 that we've been delivering um, so now I've come here for my third load, yeah, here's my third load. Um, and now I'm getting loaded with the tarmac. So body is up slightly, as you can see. I've got eight tons in at the moment. Um, and they are actually loading quite slow, to be honest. <laughs> um, it's just a little a little 360 load of me. So a bit annoying, because the guys that are on the job with me already, as well, sorry, have already left. They left about 10 minutes ago, so... Um, so yeah, I'm going to be finishing later than them. So, now what we've got to do is get loaded with this tarmac, take it back to the quarry, get reloaded with 6F5, bring it back here again to dump it somewhere in front of you where you can see there, then phone the office and find out what we're doing from there. Might be back to the yard, I expect so, because it'll probably well, it will be, it'll be about 4 o'clock when I'm here, so... Uh, two, no, it won't, two, it'll be about 3 o'clock when I'm here, maybe half 3. So, yeah, back to the yard from there sounds good. Or it might be a case of going back to the quarry, get reloaded for the morning. We don't know. We'll have to wait and see. But, yes, I've decided to just continue vlogging for the whole day uh, so you can see what my actual day is like. But I do plan on doing weekly vlogs whereby I vlog uh, a little bit each day. And then if I go to the same site, like on a Monday and then on a Thursday, you can see how it's grown in those four days. Because sites do grow quite fast. Not, not so much at the moment because of the whole COVID stuff, but when they're on full whack, so <laughs> sites change quickly. Um, you never know which way you're going in. Last time I was here, we came in through that gate. And now there's a big hole in the road. <laughs> you know what I mean? I like, can you see that hole in the road? Yeah, you can just about see it. There's a bloody hole in the road, look. <laughs> so yeah, that's the, um, the situation we're in now. We've been, we've been sat still now for 17 minutes. 17 minutes and we've got just under 10 ton on so we'll be here for another five or ten minutes at least unless it's not a full load i don't know 
I don't know, but it is tarmac we're taking, so we're going to put tarmac down on the paperwork. And we've been sat here for 17 minutes, so that was at one o'clock. I will need to put down the uh, the timer when I arrived and left on this site, that's all. But yeah, just had a very interesting email, as I said earlier, from TomTom. Tom. Um, they're sending me out a device to do a product review on, and uh, I might have one to give away, but obviously more on that at a later date. But um, yeah, might have one to give away. In fact, I will have one to give away, but <laughs> Right, let's get this on, come on, load me, come on. Are we done? I think we're done. Okay. We'll be done. Let's go over this bridge. Still need to get a signature, but the guy on the um, on the gate's been signing, so hopefully he can sign for this one as well. Ugh. We're locked in. Someone let me out. <laughs> He's just standing there having a fag. Can someone let me out, please? I'd like to leave. Hello? I need my paperwork signed anyway. Uh, this would be technically load four, but it would be the fifth one in total, so I'm going to put five down. Departure time is going to be about 13. Well, it's 13:20 if we leave right now, but there's no one here. <sighs> so he was there. <laughs> Yeah, he was there, ready. Okay, out we go, out we go, out we go. Excellent, right, I'm gonna put my seatbelt on. And then uh, we're gonna crack on. I'll see you in a little bit. Right, we're on our way now to, uh, uh, where we go, Newbury, with our final load. We've got our last load of the day on the back. We will make a phone call when we get there just to make sure that we are done for the day. I'm not entirely sure they're gonna send me back to the quarry anyway, because it's been a very nasty accident. Um, I'm, not, I'm not gonna go into too much detail, but there was a car in the middle of the road, and it looked like there was someone trapped in it. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> very nasty accident i managed to get past it some bloke like ushered me past and then uh two miles up the road a fire engine went whizzing back so um yeah not good i phoned the office up and i've let them know uh i suspect they're going to close the road i can't see i can't see the fire brigade uh opening up a car roof while the car is like pretty much in the middle of the road with a live lane so I think that road's going to be closed, so hopefully they're all okay. That was near Chalo. So fingers crossed they're okay. Looked like, um, wow, the car, the car's a complete write-off. The, the, the front is just, th there is no front. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, fingers crossed everything is okay there. So yeah, we're about 20 minutes away now from Newbury. We'll get this tipped off, make the phone call find out what we're doing from there. Yeah, it's been a good day. Weather's been quite nice. It's a nice sunny day. But like, not too sunny where you need your sunglasses. The sun's quite high up in the sky, do you know what I mean? So, if that makes sense. <laughs> the sun's high in the sky. Yeah, well done, Luke. <laughs> um, right, let's go, uh, let's go to the site and let's get this tipped off. Tip top, tip top, tip top. Ah, oh, so annoying. Stop TikToking. I'm turning green. Just checking the driving time. 
All right, green light, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Should be nothing coming. Nope, green lights, let's go. Ah. Yeah, I don't know whether that road's gonna be closed or not. Uh, uh, my sat nav does tell me if roads are closed, but um, it, might, it might be a while before it actually does, so we'll wait and see on that one. Let's go get this tipped off anyway. And there, the van's gone. It was a van here, so it stopped us from reversing in. But now we can reverse in. Back we go. We are spinning on the ground. Diff locks on. And we're up. One's over there. Excellent. Tip it all the way up. Thank you. And a bang. Just get a signature off this bloke. Bye, right, mate. You're the last one, dude. Uh, I think so, mate, yeah. Thank you very much. There you go, thank you. There we go. Cheers, All right, cheers, buddy. Yeah, I believe I'm the last one. I've been, uh, well, was I the last one all day? No, I wasn't the last one all day. It's only because I had to do that other load earlier. And then it like held me up. But um, they overtook. Otherwise, I uh, I wouldn't be the last one. Right, I just need to make a phone call and then uh, find out what we're doing from here. Okay, phone call made. We are heading back to the yard. Uh, hazards off, beacons off, in drive, seatbelt on, let's go. Watch that pedestrian because he looked a little bit strange <laughs> crossing the road. Uh, give way to the right and let's go. That reminds me, I was going to do like a, um, I watch him call it, like a, a say what you're, you're thinking drive. I've, said, I've mentioned before, like, as a driver, as a truck driver in particular, you, you always keep an eye on things that are going on. You try to be wary of everything. Like, I'm always checking my mirrors, always. Uh, I like to think I'm... I'd like to think all truck drivers check their mirrors quite regularly, but I do like to think I check mine quite a lot. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I don't, but I, I think I do. But I'm, I'm always, like, just keeping an eye out on things that are going around me. Um, I don't know. I don't know whether I'm just, like, super observant or not. So, but some people say, oh, you should concentrate less on doing vlogs and concentrate 
on more doing like your driving but like i feel like i do concentrate very well on my driving personally just my opinion i, f I feel like if anything i should be concentrating more on my driving while i'm vlogging because i'm putting my he's eating an ice cream on the wheel <laughs> do, do you know what i mean the chocolate ice cream by looks of it because it's brown but yeah i feel like i concentrate more whilst vlogging because like if i don't concentrate it's on camera and can you know get me in trouble so that kfc is open <laughs> how many times have i gone on about that kfc today anyway that is going to be the end of today's vlog i do thank you very much for watching this video um let me know if you're interested in seeing like a, a weekly vlog as in i record a bit one day i record a bit another day i record a bit another day so you you get to see me throughout the week it'd be quite interesting actually to see like the hair grow and the hair changes and maybe the tops i'm wearing and stuff like that we need to get into this lane overtake the jaguar jaguar so yeah let me know well, now it's busy in there let me know if you're interested in seeing that like a a week long vlog but like it won't be like mega long it'd just be maybe half an hour and just cut into like five or ten minute segments maybe i don't know so 10 minutes for one day 10 minutes for another day 10 minutes for another day could be interesting i don't know or let me know if you just want to see vlogs like this like it's all day but i'm just going to the same place backwards and forwards but you as you've seen today even though i've gone to the same site four times i've gone into different areas of the sites so i'm tipping in different slightly places like things change on sites all the time you can you can go to a site one day and it'll be like oh yeah you're tipping here the next day you're like tipping right over there like you know what i mean changes but yeah thank you very much for watching this video do appreciate it uh leave a like if you like it leave a thumbs down if you don't like it but hopefully you like it and uh yeah don't forget to subscribe and all that malarkey and uh i will see you in the next video thank you very much until next time drive safe stay safe and uh i'll see you soon bye bye Really want a KFC. I hit record it, Jap, you can't ignore it I'm transforming now, these cars and planes, I'm always boarding Just out touring down in Charlotte like I play for Hornets When I'm performing, never boring, now you can't afford it Champagne Perrier, finished friends on my face Looking like I'm from the deep